Welcome to CIT Library's introduction to the SAI I2I Global Platform, providing full text access to Irish, international and European standards. The I2I Platform has been designed to provide lecturers and students with accurate and up-to-date full text access to 55,000 current NSAI, that is Irish, standards. The I2I platform also lists the bibliographic content from over 350 international standard publishers covering over 1.5 million standards, references and equivalencies. In this tutorial, we will demonstrate some of the ways in which you can use this database to help with your own research. To begin, it's a good idea to register with SAI to set up a personal account. This will help you to manage your collection of documents. If you are new to searching the database for standards, it may be a good idea to just do a quick search to begin with. Using the basic search option, you can simply select a keyword or phrase, or indeed, as in this example, a standard number. Then, just run the search, which will take you directly to the results page, where you can then download the document. It is, however, recommended that you use the advanced search option when using this database, as it enables you to search specifically for document numbers and titles, as well as keywords, publishers, and, very importantly, in an Irish and European context, by location. In this example, for instance, we are searching for a particular document that is published by the International Standards Organization. Also, when you're running a search, make sure you tick this box to ensure that all the results will be current. When looking specifically for Irish or European standards, choose the NSAI option in the drop-down menu. Once you have found your document, click on the title to bring you to the document record, which gives a summary of the content as well as some publishing details. In order to view the document, simply select the version that you require. Also note that by selecting the green eyed icon at the top of the page allows you to track this document for any future updates and changes. The blue anchor allows you to copy the link to documents you are viewing so that you can paste it to your own web-based location afterwards. Remember, you will need to have registered and logged into the database to avail of any of these features. You can easily navigate through these documents using the Find Content option. This provides you with a drop-down table of contents that enables you to go directly to the section of text that is most relevant to your research. By downloading the document, you get a PDF copy of the entire document. From here, you can print or save as you wish. Returning to the document page, you will notice that there is a button that links to 20 equivalencies. These are basically related documents across all the international standards. Other search options on I2I include the option to search for a specific title. Alternatively, you can use a broader keyword search, such as the one in this example. However, when using the keyword search, it may be advisable to limit your search to our subscribed content. For example, stating specifically the NSAI, the National Standards Authority of Ireland. Another good way of searching I2I might be to use the ICS codes. Selecting from the drop-down menu, Find a descriptor that best suits your research needs. You can narrow the focus of your search using these descriptors and then finish by clicking the search button. This then will bring up the relevant results. It is also possible, of course, to browse the latest and revised versions of all the standards right up to the current. Thank you for taking the time to view this presentation. 
Remember that all the resources are freely available to registered students at CIT. Please visit the CIT Library website for further information. That's at library.cit.ie. And of course, don't forget to talk to the library staff and to find out more about our many online resources. Thank you.